Today, Rode have launched the Wireless Go 2, the successor to their hugely popular Wireless Go system. This is a 2.4 GHz digital audio system aimed at giving the entry-level customers the best possible professional audio quality at a reasonable price point. And the original was just hugely popular because of its size and its cost. I mean, these things are tiny and they're so convenient to use. But with the Wireless Go 2, Rode have made a few massive, massive changes. The first, and the most obvious by far, is that rather than being a single transmitter to a single receiver system like the original, the Wireless Go 2 is now a dual channel system with two transmitters going into one receiver. This means you can very simply work with two speakers in an interview situation, for example, while keeping your setup very small and minimal. The receiver itself is no bigger than the original and exactly the same size as either transmitter, which is hugely impressive. It takes up next to no space on your camera at all. Getting everything you need for a dual receiver into a tiny little package like this is a very impressive feat of engineering. One slight criticism I would have of this design though is that you wouldn't get particularly quick access to your audio levels, which when you have a dual system like this is quite useful. Say you're recording an interview like this one here, and you notice one person is just that little bit quiet or loud. On most systems that we're used to, there are actual physical dials, so you can just reach over and adjust them either up or down very quickly and very easily. On this, you're gonna have to use the two buttons on the actual top of the receiver. With two transmitters connected, the right-hand button is gonna cycle between the two, and then the left-hand button will cycle between your audio levels. But you'll only be able to go one way, so if you go too far or you need to adjust it the other way, you're gonna to have to cycle through all of the options to get to it, and that might well be changing your audio levels as you do that. So it's not perfect, but it's also not the end of the world. And that's the compromise you're gonna to have to make for having this much functionality in such a tiny system. It's always going to come with some usability challenges. The other major new feature that you're going to get is 24 hours worth of onboard recording capability, directly on built-in storage inside each transmitter. So no need for SD cards or anything like that. This is all controlled via a new app, the Rode Central app. And this also gives you access to a few other advanced features like safety channel recording to protect against unexpected changes in volume, plus finer control over your gain settings. However, we haven't seen this app yet, so we'll have to show you that in the next video once we actually physically get our hands on the unit. But having backup recording on the actual transmitters themselves, it's a huge deal. The main limitations of the wireless go systems, or any other affordable system for that matter, is that you might well get some dropouts, especially when your line of sight is compromised. These use 2.4 GHz wireless as well, which is the same wide frequency that most Wi-Fi based products use. So the chance of interference is much higher than on other frequencies. Having a built-in backup recording just gets around all of that. If you get a dropout during an important recording, you know that you can get around it. It could make the Wireless Go system a much more professional audio solution, especially for work like events. Apart from those two main new features, lots here is very similar to the originals. The design looks very similar. The battery life is the same stated seven hours and there's the same little USB-C port on each unit. The kit comes with a receiver and two transmitters, three USB cables, a 3.5 millimeter cable to connect it to a camera, windshields for the transmitters, plus a soft carry pouch to actually keep them all in. We're hoping to receive stock of these very soon indeed. So if you want to actually order one for yourself, then just head over to proev.co.uk and hopefully it shouldn't be too long at all, maybe even a few days before you actually get your hands on them. We're gonna be looking at these in more detail, especially the app and the recording capabilities very soon. So if you have any questions at all about the Rode Wireless Go 2, let us know in the comment section of this video and we can try and actually get you the answers once we get hands on with one. But for now, Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.